This morning, we're looking at Capital Land Malaysia Trust or CLMT, which is buying Queen's Bay Mall in Penang for 991 million ringgit. The acquisition will be partly funded by 495 million ringgit in proceeds from a private placement. CGSA MB Research says it's keeping its hold rating and target price of 54 cent. CLMT last traded at 52 and a half cent. So Queen's Bay Mall, it's one of the largest retail malls in Penang, strategically located within the Bayan Lepas Industrial Free Trade Zone. It benefits from high shopper catchment from both Penang Island and the mainland. The mall has an occupancy rate of 95%, higher than the average occupancy of 71.5% for shopping malls in Penang. It's also higher than CLMT's and September average occupancy rates for its five retail malls of 83.1%. Its inclusion raises CLMT's portfolio occupancy rate to 85.8%. In FY21, Queen's Bay Mall's rental income was 81 million ringgit, while annualised 8-month FY22 net property income or NPI stood at 75.4 million ringgit for an estimated NPI margin of over 65%. Based on CGSCIMB's preliminary estimates, the inclusion of the mall will raise CLMT's FY23 and 24 net profit by 64 to 82%. It's seen bumping up FY23 and 24 distribution per unit by 21 to 41%, lifting CLMT's FY23 to 24 dividend yield to 8.5 to 10.1% from 7.1 to 7.2% currently. CGSCIMB says it's positive on this acquisition as it immediately enhances future earnings and mitigates the underperformance of CLMT's Clang Valley retail assets, but it's keeping the hold rating pending the placement exercise and completion of the deal. So what's the consensus? According to Bloomberg Data, there are six holds on CLMT. Average target price 54 cent. CLMT closed at 52 and a half cent yesterday, so that implies a potential upside of just 2.8%.